Hi everybody. This is Zelda Maniac, and welcome back to Golden Sun. This time, we helped Ivan find his master's rod. Now, we're gonna go on forward to try and catch up with Satoru Simonardi. Go my cave! It's a cave. It's. That's all there is to it. Oh, and we got two new enemies. Wait. Actually, just one enemy. That would be Ghost. This thing. That looks like a knockoff Poe. Ghost has a health of 38, PP of 6, Attack 38, Defense 12, Agility 12, Block 2, Turns 1. Power to Venus, 100. Power to Mars, 95. Power to Jupiter, 95. And Mercury, 95. Resistance to Venus, 48. Resistance to Mars, 72. Resistance to Jupiter, 7. And resistance to Mercury, 100. Alright, let's kill these things. Blow them away. There, we took care of the discount pose. Yeah, I should have realized that. Isaac is now a level 5 squire. Maximum HP 8. Maximum PP 3. Attack by 3. Defense by 2. Agility by 4. And we got 18 coins. And everyone else sucks. Actually, we're not bad at this point. Here's another new enemy. Willhead. HP 54. PP 0. Attack 42. Defense 10. Agility 10. Luck 1. Turns one. Power of Venus one hundred. Mercury, no, not Mercury, Mars eighty. Jupiter eighty. Mercury ninety five. Resistance to Venus, 25. Resistance to Mars, 72. Resistance to Jupiter, 48. Er, resistance to Mercury, 127. Now just let me make sure I got that right. All right, I did. Now 
to get rid of them. Sorry, I have some papers in front of me of all the monsters' stats, and sometimes my eyes get a My focus tends to go everywhere else. Okay, the last new enemy for here. Skeleton. Thankfully, this one will be red easily. HP, 60. PP, 0. Attack, 46. Defense, 14. Agility, 18. Luck, 1. Turns, 1. Venus power, 100. Mars power, 80. Jupiter power, 80. Mercury power, 95. Resistance to Venus, 25. Resistance to Mars, 72. Resistance to Jupiter, 48. And resistance to Mercury, 127. Good thing we don't have Mercury yet. Now, let's blow him away. Or we can burn him back to hell. That's cool too. Oh, carrots first eye, Jenny. Did you see something strange over there? I fought it, but it fled. I returned, saw it again. I wonder if it likes this place. <coughs> Garrett is now a level 5 guard. HP raises by 7, PP raises by 3, attack by 4, defense by 2, agility 3, and 18 coins. And Ivan gets nothing. I spoke too soon. Ivan is now a level 5 Windseer. HP races by 7, PP by 4, Tech by 4, Defense by 2, Agility by 4, and 25 coins. And we got an herb. Oh, I assume with the stakes, I would be stressed out too. Especially running into these assholes nonstop. That wasn't a lucky medal, that was an unlucky medal. Yes. 
stats don't look that good. Her peepee's kinda meh. But I know we fight this one. Well, let's go. Mars the Genie appeared. HP 172. PP 14. Attack 45. Defense 9. Agility 22. Luck 6. Turns 1. Venus power 95. Mars power 125. Jupiter power 95. Mercury power, 75. Resistance to Venus, 100. Resistance to Mars, 193. Resistance to Jupiter, 100. And resistance to Mercury, 25. Now, believe it or not, each Dijeni that we'll come across actually has different stats. Unless it's power and resistance. And sometimes those little assholes run off. Okay, let's try it again. Summon Venus. Do I have anything? No, just weed. Let's go for Ray. And. Let's try that. Yeah, there's no point in doing it. Oh, we got a lot of weed. Why not? But I know we're close to the end of the cave. Okay. Come on. We got it. Of his expressions. The Mars Dejuni Forge has joined us. Wow, you got it? Wow, that's pretty impressive. Keep your eyes peeled for others like it. No, I can move on with my life. Okay, we'll set him. Now, Forge. Forge here, boost party attack with Flame's Fury. In other words, boost everybody attack. Now, we are going to go and hopefully avoid any more battles. Which, with my big mouth, that's probably not gonna happen. Okay, we can make it, we can make it. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Okay. 
Okay, this is the town of Bilbin, and there's a tree here. Hmm. Ivan, let's read his mind. Help me, somebody. It's a tree, but it almost looks like a man? Well, talk about placing your roots. Welcome to Bil Bilbin? Please, just ignore that strange tree up front. Many brave warriors have been sent to Golema. Travelers need and worry. Yes, we did. Well. Oh, hey, money. Lord McCoy has been quite frightened since the incident. Well, I will be too. Okay, a large group crossed over Goma Range heading toward Emil. That would be where the first film of the lighthouse is at. But before we do Yeah. Yeah, we know everything changed. Shut up, I wanna check the pot. I want to check the jar here. Let me check the jar already. Okay, you know what? Whatever. Probably nothing there anyway. Yeah, chances are it's probably the sake of tree. Do you believe a tree spirit can curse a man? Hmm, someone hasn't played a Zelda game. It's hard not to believe after you've seen that tree up front. I'm really worried about Koloma. I was born there, you know? I can't even focus on my cooking. And as we can tell by the music, there's trouble. But first, we gotta heal up. Thank you. Take care of this little thing. McCoy's hidden warehouse. Do not enter. Oh, of course. We gotta go to the other way. And there's a Daijin right there. Oh, well. can we get armor-wise? Oh. God, these prices are high. I mean, these prices are higher than me on a Wednesday. I should just wait a bit. Okay, so the road to Koma is blocked now. Oh, I know what to do. Let me get that Dajini. 
and know again. Yes. Jupiter Daijin Gus joined Ivan. Ivan here attacks with Mighty Wind Gus. Pretty straightforward. Like with Garrett's. And I'm saving now because I am scared of a GBA player just freezing up. Goes up by four, just goes up by two. Wow, that is. Let's get rid of some baggage. There is a usage for the game tickets, but that's much later. I think we have done a lot for this video. Next time on Golden Sun, after I grind a little bit off screen to get some decent equipment, we're gonna go visit Lord McCoy, see if there's anything we can do. Feel free to comment, like, share, and subscribe if you wish. Ring the notification bell if you wish to. Peace out, and stay maniacal in a good way.